The point is this, whoever sows sparingly will also reap sparingly. If you put a little in, you're only gonna get a little out. Whoever sows bountifully will also reap bountifully. If you put a lot in, you're gonna get a lot out. Each one must give as he decides in his heart. Each person has to give, talking specifically about offering or tithing here. Each one must give as they decide in their heart, not reluctantly or under compulsion. For God loves a cheerful giver. There are way too many churches across our country that convince people to give and people give under compulsion, not conviction. They give because they hear a good sermon, not because God has moved in their heart and they're cheerful about it. I never want someone to give to Lighthouse Church and go home and regret that decision. That is giving under compulsion. It says God loves a cheerful giver and God is able to make all grace abound to you so that having all sufficiency in all things at all times, you may abound in every good work. That's a lot of alls and you know how much I love the word all. He loves a cheerful giver. We do not want anyone at Lighthouse Church to give under compulsion. Because when we talk about matters of finance, we can't ignore the fact that money has a connection to the heart. 